That's going to bring us into our final topic, John, just what you said in regards to our cinemas opening up, because um, obviously, you know, we're going to uh, be able to get more access to Western films where we are in our neck of the woods, but Mm -hmm. in the neck of the woods uh, in India... Uh, we are getting some release dates now, and it's actually Kumar's belt. Uh, 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 John, I'll exactly. tell you something. Forbes on iPads does not work. Nope. I had to get into a desktop version of it doesn't because it was coming up either. with Shit. it was coming up with a large image of uh, actually Kumar, and I was like, I, I can't see any words. I just see his forehead, but I've what, managed good, to man. get it. He's yeah. Good. That's, I'll tell you something, the guy, yeah, the guy just looks cool as anything. Look yeah. at that hair. Uh, but actually, Kumar, this is coming from Forbes, as we said, John, as Bell Bottom and uh, at Drangi Ray gets God, a release shoot. date <laughs> with more films hitting Indian theatres in 2021. John, I'm, I know you're glad it's me, but I'll tell you something. Before we go down the rabbit hole of doing these articles, um, I will read these over and over, and sometimes they roll off the tongue. And sometimes they just don't. So <laughs> I just have to. Malaya yeah, I just. I just have to accept that sometimes I will make a total ass of it. But John, <laughs> uh, the release dates. I'm just going to read this article actually because um, I like to put myself under these sort of pressures. And the release dates for two of actually Kimmel's films, Bell Bottom and At Rangi Ray, were announced on Friday. Bell Bottom is slated to hit theatres on. May 28th, while At Rangi Ray will release on August 6th, 2021. The films are likely to accelerate business for theatres that are yet to be back on track in India after the seven-month shutdown that ended in October last year. Oh, you're so, so lucky. <laughs> so, so lucky. A teaser Hi. for Bell Bottom that features Huma <laughs> Quershi, Laura Dutta, Vani Cooper and Adil Hussain and the lead roles was unveiled on Friday. Major, uh, Many major films went from digital only released last year, fearing long-term impact of the pandemic as cinemas remain shut down for months. Kumar's horror comedy lacks me. I think we reacted oh, to that, John. Dynamite. Surreal. Surreal. <laughs> Also landed online in 2021 alongside several other big ticket films, including Vija Balan's Shakuntalala Devi. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, uh, Amitra Bakchans, Gulabus Sitabu, and Javi Kapoor starrer Gungan Saxena, the Karagil Girl. Oh, it's so late, and I, did, I think I did well. However, many filmmakers decided to wait it out and postpone their movies. Earlier this year, the Indian government allowed cinema halls to function in full capacity. After the order, many major films have been confirmed for theatrical release, including the Salman Khan's Radi Your Most Wanted By, <laughs> some title, which is slated for release on Aid. 2021. John, it's just like you were saying there, you know, um, finally we're going to come out of this um, other side of this shutdown, this lockdown, and um, we will be able to access uh, the films that we're used to seeing um, and the ones that have been sort of held back. And you're absolutely right. Part of me, most of me, really wants to see more Indian films being released here in the UK and Glasgow, where we are. Um, Sadly, I think it's going to be the the film theatre here in Glasgow that will probably be more accessible to get these films mm-hmm. um, but the other question is John that um, with uh, Indian cinema now being um, or Indian cinemas now sort of open to full capacity do you think there will be more or, or sorry would you think there will be less films being released on the likes of Amazon Prime because I think we've had this luxury for the last six months where we've had a lot of access to a lot of Indian cinema on Netflix, on Amazon Prime, uh, on VOD as well. Yep. Do you think that will? Do you think this will slow down? Do you think it will, it will end up? We'll not get these films uh, as accessible right away. Probably not, Stephen. Because as we, yeah, you know, we used to do box office breakdowns, and there was big Indian releases hitting the top ten. Mm. I was completely ignorant to them back then, but there was. It was huge hits coming into the box office, because we've got a huge Indian sort of community here, Scotland, United Kingdom in general. <clears throat> so I think we will see some of the huge hits getting into theatres over here, and they'll probably it'll be a longer period until they hit the streaming services. I still think there'll be a lot of Indian releases going straight to Amazon Prime over in the United Kingdom, though. Uh, and 
but maybe that the likes of actually Kumar's movies, the, the, the likes of Bellbot, maybe ones that do hit the streaming service, I don't know. We'll just need to wait and see how it plays out, Stephen. But I do think the likes of like a Bahu Bali or a Master or maybe even a KGF or something like that, that would, I think, hit the theatres over here. I don't think we'd see that going straight to Amazon Prime. It's just too big yeah. a release, plain and simple. We've got comments here. Um, I cannot read them because, to be quite frank with you, I'm blind as a bat. See, it's something that Buck sent us. Hi. How you doing? Nice to see you. Thank you for sending us, whoever that is. I don't know, we, we do not have access to any sort of shit going on over on Twitch. It's just comments hitting on yeah. Streamlabs. We're complete goons when it comes to Twitch. We, we, we stream primarily on YouTube and we, we use Streamlabs, whatever the hell it is, man, the premium prime to sort of restream over to Twitch as well. So thank you for coming over and watching us. We do appreciate it. We're hitting the end here. We're hitting a wall. It's very, very late. It's five to one in the morning here, man. So we are yeah. doing our best not to make complete tits of ourselves. Kevin Feige <laughs> sent me. <laughs> Kevin really? Feige sent you all. Can you give me Kevin Feige's direct number then, man? I'd like to speak to Kevin Feige. Um, Steve, I can't read these comments, man, but I do appreciate them coming in anyway. Uh, but yeah, Stephen, I've been looking at it. Bell Bottom. Bell Bottom looks very interesting, man. We've got Akshay mm. Kumar sitting on a car. He's in a suit. Looks super to me. I'd give that a like <laughs> the, other one, the other one doesn't look so good. It looks a bit, yeah. sh- to be quite frank, it looks a bit poor. It's a comedy, uh, musical, romantic drama thing, and it's getting poor ratings. So, yeah, can't speak on that one. But. Th- Bellbottom, <laughs> for sure, does look decent to yeah. me. I'm going to read the comments here, Stephen. I'll put you on, man. Yeah. John, I think, um, just before you do, I think um, uh, oh, sure. May, 20, May, May 28th um, for Bellbottom is um, what it's been slated for its release in, in theatres in India. And uh, Atragan Ray is the 6th of August. Um, I don't think we are going to get these films. I think possibly... I think we'll get them on the streaming channels as well. Uh, streaming platforms, sorry. I don't think we'll be getting these kind of films uh, in cinema. And um, I think you're right. I think I think it's going to be the big hitters that we're going to get over here. And I still think um, we don't get access to the big hitters in the sort of large chains here in Glasgow, um, which is a shame, you know. I, I've never seen... Steve, I've, no, not for the him backboard. anyway, John. Not, yeah, I, I think it's a... There is an ignorance, you know, and I think um, <laughs> our, our best bet would be the Glasgow Film Theatre uh, to see any Indian releases, sadly. No, it's not, it's not really sadly, because I think we'd be able to get to get to go and see the film in a theatre that we do enjoy, but I think, sadly, um, for wider audiences, um, they're not going to be exposed to these great films. They won't, Stephen, that's a shame. But to be honest with you, I don't think the vast majority of Glasgow would be interested in watching things like that, as you do know. Not the most cultured people are us. We like our drink and that's about it. But look, man, again, I don't know if that's been a raid over on Twitch, man. I don't know what the score is with people coming in, but we do appreciate you coming in, man. Um, again, complete goons on Twitch. We've not even got Twitch up, man. We've got no bots, nothing. It's a shambles. But we'll try and sort that out shortly. I do I imagine we'll try and get our shit together on Twitch, Stephen. But look, that's going to round the show up, man. It's going to round it up. We are hit-